Today from r slash just know mother-in-law. Mother-in-law found out my husband got a vasectomy. I, 27 female, and husband, 28 male, have been together for over 10 years and have two beautiful children together. He and I decided before we even got married that we only envisioned us having two kids. After our second baby was born, we both knew in our hearts that our family was complete. We had the decision and mutually decided on him getting a vasectomy. I did offer going on long-term birth control, but he knows my body gets all sorts of wonky and hormonal on birth control, and he said he was perfectly fine getting the vasectomy. He had it done and recovered easily, as well as passing his post-op exams with flying colors, if you will. My parents knew about it because they were watching our children while we were at the appointment. His parents didn't. He said he didn't want them to know because he was embarrassed about his mom and dad knowing his personal business. Okay, no biggie. So his sister just had a baby and we offered pretty much everything our kids grew out of that would be helpful to them growing a family. When sister-in-law asked if we were 100% sure, I responded, yes, we are absolutely done having kids. And she asked if he had gotten a vasectomy, thinking we could trust her with that information. We said yes. Well, that tidbit got back to mother-in-law, and she was not happy. She always pictured having loads of grandkids. Like she told him years ago, that she wants at least eight. I don't know where the other six kiddos are going to come from, but we are done. He has siblings that can just as easily reproduce. Mother-in-law is now blaming me for tricking her son into the vasectomy. Why does mother-in-law even care what is going on within our marriage? Also, I did no such trickery. It was him who suggested the vasectomy and made the appointments. The man is stubborn as a mule, so there was no freaking way I could force him to do anything. I could barely convince him to cut his hair shorter for our wedding. If he was that stubborn about his hair, why would he suddenly be a doormat for a good old snippy snip? Now I'm frustrated. We didn't necessarily tell sister-in-law to keep it a secret, so that's on us. We also didn't think she'd share that sort of news, given it's a bit more personal. Mother-in-law probably pried on why we were giving her all our old stuff. I don't know exactly where I'm going with this ramble. I just needed to get it out there, because surely someone else has been in this situation too.